In this video, I'm going to show you how to easily copy and paste tables from DeepSeq to Word document. So over here, I just created a random table with some random data over here inside the DeepSeq. And of course, you would think just going down here and clicking this copy button over here would actually do something. Now, let me copy this and go to my Word over here. If I paste it, as you can see, yes, there's data. However, it's not a table and the table didn't get directly pasted in here and you would have to essentially create a table manually and input this data into the table if you would like to have a table inside the Word document. However, there's a nice little trick you can do and you can take so you can actually convert this into a table instantly. So what you want to do is go back over here to DeepSeq and you want to just highlight all this data. So don't click the copy button, just highlight all this data over here. So highlight it like this, make sure it's marked, there we go. And then you wanna copy it by either clicking Control C on your keyboard or right click copy. You wanna then go back to your Word and over here, you wanna simply paste it in here. And as you can see, it's now an actual table. Now it looks a bit funny, but you can customize it. I'm gonna show you how to do it a bit later in a second. But if it's not showing like this for you, what you have to do is go down here to the very bottom right where it says paste options, click on that. And then you wanna make sure you have it on either merge formatting or on keep source formatting. As you can see, both are actual tables. The difference is just the size and basically the font and that's pretty much it. So you can uh, switch between these two, but don't have it on keep text only because if you have text only, this isn't really a table. Yet again, it's just some random text. So make sure it's either this one or this one, whichever looks better to you. So for me, I'm just gonna take this one over here and this is now an actual table inside Microsoft Word and you can, uh, as you can see over here, you can select it by just clicking on it over here on this uh, button top left. You can basically extend it, resize it as you wish, and then you can go to table design and even design it to your own needs over here. So as you can see, you can of course um, change it however you want. Now, right now the text is the wrong color because it's uh, kind of whitish. So you can convert everything. You can convert it to this one, for example, and then go to over here and change the text color to, for example, darker. So let me do this again. There we go. And now it looks quite clean. You can, of course, change the layouts and the colors of shading, etc. if you want to as well, and basically customize it according to your own needs. So that's basically the way you can do this and get the table from DeepSeq to your Word document. I tried telling it to actually create and convert this table into a Word document because ChatGPT, as of my knowledge, can do it. So it can convert anything into a Word document. However, unfortunately, as of right now, DeepSeq seems to not have the option to actually do it. So you will have to just manually copy and paste it, but it's quick anyway, so it doesn't take too much work. Now, that's pretty much it. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.